What's up, data people? My name is Matthew Heffron, and today's quick tutorial is on replacing null values. I created this little sample data set, and we have month, first name, last name, and inside last name, I threw in a couple nulls, and bank account deposits, I also threw in a couple nulls. So we're going to show you two different methods to replace null values. So let's jump right into it. Let's first look at last name. So let's grab last name, and we're going to say duplicate. Let's go ahead and edit this. And we'll say no nulls. What we want to use for this first, since this is a, last name is a string value, we're going to use if null. So we're saying if the last name is null, let's replace it with a string called na. And that's all there is to it. We hit OK. And we can grab last name. Let's drop it on rows. So you can see wherever we had a null, it is now replaced with NA. Next, let's look at bank account deposits. So we can say duplicate, edit, come up here, no, nulls. And we're going to use a different function. We're going to use ZN. Okay, and if we come over here, you can look up ZN. ZN just returns the expression if it is not null, otherwise it returns zero. So wherever we have this null, we're going to replace it with zero. So let's hit OK. And we'll grab that, drop that on measure values, and now you can see wherever there was a null value, it's replaced with zero. Thanks for watching today's quick tutorial on replacing null values.